Hello everyone! This is Dookie Davy Crafts. My name is Dookie Davy, but you can just call me Dookie. Today, we are going to be painting a beautiful picture using Q-tips. This is a really fun and simple craft. All you need is some paint. Of course, you can use whatever color paint you want, but it might be a good idea if you have either brown paint or black paint for the trunk of the tree. You will also need one paintbrush for the trunk of the tree, this is the paintbrush that I'll be using. But you can use whatever paintbrushes that you have at home. Some paper that's really good with paint. A paper plate to put all of your paint on. And of course, Q-tips. They look like this. I got all of my paint, my paint paper, and my paintbrush at my local craft store. And I got my Q-tips and my paper plate at my local grocery store. Though I think you can pretty much get paper plates and Q-tips at really any store. Grocery stores, super stores, stuff like that. You can also buy all of these supplies online if you prefer. Now that we have all of our supplies, let's get to it! First, go ahead and put your brown or black paint on your paper plate so we can make our tree trunk. I have brown paint. Now that I have my brown paint on my paper, go ahead and get your paintbrush and make your tree trunk. You can make your tree trunk like mine, or you can make your tree trunk whichever way you want. You can have complete creative freedom. Okay, now that we are all done with our tree trunk, now we can start painting the petals. Ooh, I'm so excited. This is the part where we get to use our Q-tips. So go ahead and put a little bit of paint of whatever color you want 
onto our plate. I'm going to use yellow first. Now, take a couple Q-tips, put them together like this, dip it in your paint, and start making little tiny dots for our petals on the tree. It might be a good idea to just have one color in one area of your tree. Now, you're going to use another color. Hmm, I think I might use pink. But wait a minute, I don't have any pink. What can I do? I can mix red and white to make pink. See, a beautiful pink paint for our beautiful tree. Remember, you don't have to use these exact colors that I'm using. You can use whatever colors you want. Take your next Q-tips, dip it in your paint. And now your next color. I think I'm going to do blue. Take your next couple Q-tips and keep going. And now I think I'm going to do green. But I don't think I have any green. What am I going to do? Let's see. I think I have yellow and I think I have blue. What can I do to make green? What if I mix yellow and blue? What do you think will happen? Who knows? Why don't we try it out and see? We made green! Wow, it's like magic. Take your next couple Q-tips and keep going with your picture. And remember, make sure you change out your Q-tips every time you want to change out your color. That way, we don't mix and match our colors all over the place and it doesn't look like our colors anymore. We want to make sure we change our Q-tips every single time. And now, I think I want to make orange. Let's see, what colors can I use to make orange? Let's see. I have blue, red, and yellow. Which colors should I mix together to make orange? Oh, oh, what? I think 
I heard someone say yellow and red. Well, if that's what you said, then you are 100% right. We are going to mix red and yellow together to make orange. Hmm, still kind of looks like red, doesn't it? I'll add a little bit more yellow. There we go, orange! All right, now I'm going to use orange. I have room for just one more color. I think I'm going to make purple. To make purple, you are going to mix together blue and red. And now we have purple. If you want to paint your tree a little bit more with your beautiful colorful paint, go ahead. I think I'm just going to fill in some of the little empty spaces here with my paint. Once you are all done with your tree, then if you want, you can make some beautiful grass to surround your tree. If you want, you can add a little yellow too to make it beautiful and bright. And we are all done with our picture. Isn't it beautiful? Wow, it's so pretty. Look at all the pretty colors. 
had so much fun making beautiful colors with my paint and creating a beautiful tree with Q-tips. I hope you had lots of fun too. And remember, I would love to see your beautiful paintings. If you would like to show me a picture of your beautiful painting, you can go ahead and tag me or message me on my other platforms on Facebook or on Instagram at Time to Tell a Tale. They're listed below in my description. I hope you had lots of fun painting with Q-tips with me today. Remember, this is Juki Davy Crafts. I hope to see you next time. Goodbye, everyone. Wow, it's so pretty. Q-tips, 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 Q-tips. Paint, 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 paint,